Elvis is in the house. Elvecchio comes from Brazil. He is here to enlighten us and entertain us. He is uh, the man who uh, you've organized uh, actually a whole crew of people down there in Joomla Day Brazil yes. and so forth. And no, uh, Joomla, Joomla Day, Day Rio is happening. Rio. Yes, yep. the very first is happening next week. Excellent. Yes, so, yes. so you're taking notes here so that you can do this right? Yes, yes, absolutely. Good. All right. So take it away, Helbecchio. Thank you very much. Well, uh, in 2003, I realized that I wouldn't go very far if I just uh, kept on using H static HTML websites for my work every day. So I realized that I needed something more. Then one day, one friend introduced to me Mambo CMS. I was very excited because then I realized I could provide way much more than I could until then because I'm not a developer, I'm not a programmer, I'm just a graphic designer. And, but unfortunately, something happened. I got fired from the job that I had at the time, and I really got lost because it was not a very good time in my life in several different uh, levels. And what happened is that I started through the freelance, but unfortunately, as everything was not very good, it didn't turn out as I expected. So little work, little money, not very happy at that time. I decided I should go and find a new job, and then I had an opportunity at the Rio de Janeiro State University. And it was very good, but unfortunately, it, it drove me away from the internet. There, I was just an illustrator and a graphic designer. And even though I was still in touch with Mambo, I realized that I should go further, and then Joomla was released in 2005. And then I was wondering, should I make a switch or not? I was really lost at that time. And then finally I turned 40. And turning 40, not being okay, big crisis, I had no horizon in sight, everything was a mess. So I knew I had to do something, so I started uh, to search for some answers. And uh, I had a very good strike of luck at that moment because I had an opportunity to join a business incubation institution. And they helped me uh, find out what a career is about. Then I realized that I should plan out my career. And I started doing so, just taking notes, writing down, and stuff like that. And the very first thing I realized I should do is I should change my attitude. I was very gloomy and down and sad and whining. And so I said, hey, this is not me. I was not always like that. I was very happy. And then I started looking at the brighter side of life again. One thing that was happening at that time is that I already knew Joomla, and I realized that Joomla was the thing that would help me the most. So I focused all my work on Joomla. And then I decided that I had to get in contact with the Joomla community, a local Joomla community. And it was very good because then I started having new work, more money, of course. And on the very next year in Rio de Janeiro, there was the Joomla Day Brazil. It was such a great experience because it was the very Joomla Day that I was attending to. And I met a lot of people. And uh, a lot of things changed. And then on this very same year, I had the opportunity to come to New York and take a Joomla course and attend Joomla Day in New York also, which uh, helped me when I came back to Brazil to improve my skills while teaching and make uh, Joomla, um, which was something that impressed a lot of people uh, back home. In the next... Uh, Later, in 2010, I attended my second Joomla Day in New York, and I had the opportunity to make my very first presentation, which was awesome because I was doing it in another country, in another language, and it was something that excited me very much. And then I learned that if I wanted to go on and sell Joomla to other people, I also had to learn about my competition. And, of course, we had to learn about other CMSs. And so at this point, I realized that I was ready to take a step further. And so, yes, I opened my business. And uh, I got some more clients. Things are getting better. And I can um, 
go to other places. And of course, in 2012, I came to Joomla World Conference, which was a great thing. I really joined the community. Now I'm a contributor as an illustrator for the Joomla magazine. And I realized that's the place that I should be and that I want to be. Thank you very much. My name is Alvester. I am from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. I'm a graphic and web designer, and I love Joomla. Thank you. Well done.